What is up, guys? Welcome to the second episode of Noble Face. Thank you guys so much for tuning on into another episode. In the last episode, we just started building up our base. I drew a lot of analogies from this game uh, with RimWorld having a lot of similarities, which is cool because I think RimWorld's an awesome game. But in this episode, it looks like we're about to be attacked. So we're going to enlist some fighters here. I think we should just snag both these people. So let's highlight them real quick. Uh, select the two spine nobles. Hit T to enlist them. We're going to tell them to enlist. And then y'all are going to pick you two. You're going to go fight this guy. Hold up. Select two. Push. And hold position. Really? Oh, I think they just have me like kind of going through everything. I'm assuming we don't have any ranged weapons. So... He's holding on to an axe. He has an axe in hand, so just go for it, guys. Let's see how this goes. So you can micromanage this really well in uh, in RimWorld. So I'm assuming you can do the same in here. So like, if he gets low, we're going to back him off. Um, we don't want either of them to die here. We just kind of want to slowly... Let's actually pause this real quick. I'm going to have him attack two. And then we're going to swarm him. So let's play it slow. And if I need to back someone off, I will. And we can just pause. Berg. 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 A little too low. A little too low, buddy. Where's my guy? Where's my... Meat! Hurry up, dude! Alright. If Berg gets hit one or two more times, I'm backing him off. I'm just going to right-click back. I think he's also our king. So we really shouldn't have our king doing these fights here. It's really dangerous. Dangerous move. Oh, nice block. Oh, didn't... Oh. I'm on the way out. All right, Berg. I'm going to back you up, buddy. Nope, you blocked. Okay, let's back you off. Let's back you off. All right, and now you can probably go back in. Yeah. Finish him off. Don't let him run. Come on. He's trying. Let's go. Woo. Nice. So now we can highlight these guys and unenlist them, I think. And they will just go back to their normal, the normal day-to-day -day stuff. Yep, there you go. And then we're just going to right-click this guy. Maybe we have to highlight him? Yep. He's dead. Oh, no. So clean up all this. So you need to clean this up. But how do we issue a loot command? Let me click on someone there and just click on like, well, who's this right here? Berg? Right click, loot whisperer. Thank you, buddy. We're gonna have to probably bury him too. My assumption. Look at all the stuff we're getting out of him. All right. Um, butcher, bury. So you want to bury him. Uh, if you butcher him. Oh, no grave available. Hmm. Do we want to build a grave? Can we build a grave quick? Yeah, we we'll have to build a grave quick. Um, actually, that might be a little too close. Can we destroy that? Delete. Cancel. Insufficient stones. We definitely need a grave, though. We can't just let this guy's body sit here. It's going to get, like, smelly. It's really weird how the game kind of does that. Um, hmm. Oh, he's, they're going to do everything as, as soon as they get around to it. Okay, whatever. They're going to get around to it when they get around to it. That's, that's, that's the thing. All right, good. I, I didn't realize that. It's just, it's just not their priority right now. Left-click belongings tool? Where's that? Oh, cool. New stuff. Oh, nice. Um, Cool. Who's this? Uh, Filter Berg. Is this a trading system? I don't know if this is trading or not. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where are you, who are you giving it to? 
I don't know who you gave that to. Oh, whatever. We're currently collecting a bunch of... We have a lot, like, on a plate. And I, we're going to naturally store this guy. I just... Where's stones? Are these stones? That's copper. Yeah, don't waste copper to freaking clean that guy up. Yeah, and now we're storing all that. We'll end up cleaning up the blood, too. Oh, is that? That's not stone. What's that? Scat? Okay, well, you're not going to clean up scat. That seems stupid. Seems like a waste of time. Is that stone? That's a small tree. <laughs> the struggles of trying to find... Is that, that stone? Gather it, baby. Gather it. All right, cool. Then we'll have stone. Then we can uh, finally bury this guy who... He definitely needs to be buried like it is a uh, it is a necessity we cannot leave him out i really don't like the location of that but i don't know how to move it. i don't know how to delete it like cancel it delete okay. oh cancel build there you go and we can just hit this and build a better grave so we don't want the graves near our place for obvious reasons so you can put the grave over there and we have it out of the way, which is perfect. All right, great. And then we can bury him finally. Wait, where's his body? Wait, why'd you put his body in the... No, bury it, dude. Why'd you put him in the in the stockpile without food? Get him out of there, man. Don't leave him in the stockpile without food. Ooh, past wanderers are visiting. Poots. What do you got? Usually you can engage with these guys somehow. Pristine. What do you guys want me to do with them? Hmm. Speak to your people. Oh. All right, left click your ruler. Uh, right click someone and ask them their thoughts. Okay, so let's slow it down. I'm going to ask. Speak to Snippy. What's on your mind? What's on your mind? Berg. Asking Snippy. The Triumph Sheep raided us. Yeah. I hate Chieftain Silvio because Chieftain Silvio declared war with me. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be honest with Snippy. We can't like him. He freaking declared war. Snippy a lot. Snippy loves Berg! Let's go, baby! Isn't Chieftain Silvio garbage? Ah, he didn't like Chieftain Silvio either. I love it. Speak to meat. Does meat like Chieftain Silvio? I should check that before I talk to him. Hates the triumph sheep? Wait, was that us? Wasn't that us? I can't remember which one's trying. Are we triumph sheep or is the, are they triumph sheep? Cool. No, loves the question spine. No, where are the question spine? I think that friendship stands above all else. Nothing. Okay, whatever. This is that's all you want to say. That's all you want to say. Should we talk to this guy? Go speak to Poots. Poots. Go speak to Poots. I didn't realize this is the order of everything on it. Uh, trade with Poots. Ask them to join. What do you got on your? You got anything good? Raw beef. Do we need beef? Uh, a little, well, people like beef, so let's just buy the beef. Like, I'll, I'll spend the money. I'll, I'll, I'll risk it all. And then, like, maybe you guys can take something I don't want. Like, opinions, people don't like this, or they, they don't want us to trade it, or they don't like it. Here, take, like, some copper. I've been collecting a lot of this. Let's let's accept this trade.
Ask what's on your mind, poots. I think raw beef is for top kingdoms. I love raw beef. Poots like that. Yeah, he likes it. I don't mind orcs. Oh. I like orcs. Orcs are... Don't you just love deer hide? I like deer hide. Okay. I guess Poots likes us. There are a few things worse than hauling, but only a few. I don't like hauling. <laughs> Poots like that. <laughs> what? I don't mind you. I like you. You want to join? Eh, whatever. I don't know. Should we ask him to join? I don't even know if we should. Do we want poots? Do we have the food and resources for poots? Shouldn't we also be wearing these? Did I just junk that? No! Cancel! No! Close. Did I... Did I just junk it? Ah. Oh. I junk something that was important. I stink. So I'm gonna go bury the dead guy and not leave him enough food. Why? Oh! Quality. Oh, wait, we want to? While well, I acquire numerous uh, through looting and trading, crafting on our own is the best. Uh, ABCs of crafting, anyways. Always. B, B. No, crafting. Crafting things will make proving skills allow learn new skills and better. Our crafting pipeline depends on upon our steady resources, so make sure we're lodging, foraging, hunting, and mining as needed. Anyways, I've got time. All right, thanks. Cool. Uh, oh, we have to go ask Poots to join us. I didn't realize that was... Speak to Poots. Capture Poots? Imagine. <laughs> that's, that's what we freaking do. Would you be willing to join us? Yes, I'm happy to swear allegiance to you guys. Welcome. Want to store all that? Yeah, you're just gonna naturally store that stuff, right? Someone burying him. We should build another uh, another bed here. Horrible spot for a bed, but you know what? It'll work. Yes, please bury that guy finally. We can't have just bodies laying around. Like, that sounds like a bad scene waiting to happen. Um, I'm just going to clear out some space over here. Like, let's just cut all those, please. We just really don't need all that. And we're going to actually expand on this house a little bit. Defense? What defense? Those are spikes. A dummy? Oh. What else can you do? Work? Benches? Oh, yeah. Is there anything else we should craft? Here. Hmm. I feel like we should just make a few, just in case. What's going on, poofs? Poots. You're buffest. Uh, I'm here for Count Chloe, the strongest toads. I would like you've done with the place. May I stay for a while? Sure. Oh, I guess we're I guess we're housing someone. Okay. Okay. I'm actually gonna expand on this structure. I think. Get a little bit more, a little bit more house over here, you know. Thank you, Poots. You're the best. And then, if we can expand on that, we can also add. We have to add walls and stuff as well. What's this? What's the difference? 
Is that like a half wall? Half wall. Interesting concept here, but hear me out. Make this its separate kind of entity. And I'll tell you why. This is my thought process, okay? If we have it deattached from the rest of the house, it prevents people from raiding both places at the same time. I know. Crazy. I know. I know. Who's our visitor? Why are they here? I don't even know why they're here. Why are you guys here? What's going on? Why are they here? Orc grappling hooks. Robes. Cooked in. Where are you? Oh, what are you doing in here? Hello? You cool? We should capture them. I don't want to capture them. I don't want to capture them. I do, but I don't. But I do. Hmm. I want to capture them. Whatever. I didn't realize this. I think this is your cue. Control your ruler? Okay. Uh, hit C. Oh, crap. You can actually... Oh, whoa. Uh, hit E to interact. Hit the squiggly? Oh, the fuck's the squiggly? Hit the squiggly to open up interface? The squiggly? Where the heck's... The oh. Close it. Wait, what's this? Oh. Just reopens up everything I was just looking at. So at any time I can just hit E. So if I click on them and hit E, I think. Was that what it was? Actually, oh, hit C. C to control, which makes sense. And I just, ooh. Okay. Oh, what am I going to do with this cotton now? You don't even know. I do know. I'm going to go put it right over here. Boom. In the stockpile. Look at that. Look at that stockpile. Look at that. Get down. Get down. What's that? Okay, so what's this? Just debris? Oh. Hmm. I'm kind of playing around. Okay. Controls seem pretty easy. Pretty intuitive. I think the... Mm, let me clean up this blood, please. I really don't think you should have just blood hanging out. I think it's, like, kind of crappy to do. I think it looks crappy, and it kind of makes me feel crappy. I ate raw beef. Well, that's good. Probably a good idea to do. A little beef here or there, you know? Back on some beef. This is an interesting thing. Different from RimWorld. There you go. There's, there's one of the big differences so far. So it's kind of weird. So on the right hand side, you can kind of see what gets prioritized. It looks like building always gets prioritized. Even if you do it later on a Sims queue, for example, they just do whatever you put in order. This one looks like they won't do that, which I've got to determine if I like or dislike. Uh, they prioritize probably what the game thinks is the most important stuff is my assumption. Whatever the game thinks is most important, which is probably building and then cleaning is always last on the list, which can't determine if I like it or not. I will let you guys know. Everyone's ready to level up too, so let's just level everyone up quickly. Should always just level them up whenever they can. I just don't pay attention. Max health on meaty. Love it. As long as everyone keeps getting stronger, man. We don't have a roof right now. 
I should get one. And look at how much cleaning that needs. I'm sure it'll get done naturally. Yeah, it's already on the clean list. Okay. We should build a roof though. Cool. There you go. Now we have separate areas. Uh, once again, separate areas, there's an idea behind it. I think raiding will happen. And the way you usually want to do it is if you think of like rust, you want multiple areas so you can keep backing up and build protection within there. So like this first area, I could put like spike traps or something. And then my people hide in the way back where they take a lot of time to get there to create safety for the future. Now, it's an assumption, once again, per usual. I have no idea if that's the case, but we will see. I will hope that that is the case. Wait, a freaking cow? Don't hunt the cow. I want to catch the cow. Catch the cow. I want to catch and train said cow. That seems like a... Ooh. We will add that to our forging list because that looks like a lot of good food. We can hunt and catch. We can tame a buck, but we can't tame a cow. Come on. Think that through, game. Why the heck can I tame a buck, but there's a freaking cow? Like, perfect taming ability. A uh, cow, please. Please. Look at all that meat. What's going on, joke? Map's huge. All right, guys. That is the end of this episode. We did a nice fight. We started welcoming visitors. We got a buck wanderers. I guess we'll catch them next episode. They don't like nice. I don't think I like them. We'll see. We'll see. All right, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'll catch you guys in a future episode. If you guys enjoy the content, go do those things. Thank you guys so much for watching and all that stuff. I'll see you guys.